gave birth, flat as a pancake. Number four, right on schedule. Here, six. Now I just came into the office and you know what? She gave birth, check it out. I think it's uh, overall a pretty good batch. We have seven babies, and uh, now I'm gonna catch them out, put them in a separate tub, and check out the sex and see what we got. Let's see. That's a beauty. Okay, let's check out the sex. Bam, it's a female. That's what everyone wants, right? We got one female. I'm gonna put it in here. Let's take a look. Looking good? All right. And this one, he's closing up his fins. It looks like it's a male. Let's see here. Whoops. Yep, it's a male. See the sex. And this one looks like I think it's a male too, huh? Right? Yep, it's a male too. If the footage is not coming out too good, it's because I got a new cameraman here. <laughs> this first time, you guys know. Female. It looks like a female. Alright. We don't need to sex this one. We did it already. Get closer, dude. Get closer. Let them see what it looks like. Man, it's it amazing. Nice. Get in tight on it, let them see the quality of the fish. Newborns. Newborn pure black diamonds. What do we got here? Another female. I lost track. How many males and how many females were so far? <laughs> no idea. See the sex. Another female. Cha ching Man. Last one. Is it gonna be a male or female, guys? This is the joy of breeding stingrays. This is the moment when seeing the babies come out and all the hard work paying off. the moment I live for. This is why I do this business. For the love of the fish. That's Oh, this one is nice. That's really nice. Yep. Yeah. Okay. 
Male or female? Let's male see. is mine. Female is yours. Oh man, it's a male. I can't give it to you, man. <laughs> All right, well, it's done. Let's uh, show them the, the whole basket, how it looks. Looking good. Looking good. Seven batch, seven babies. And um, we're waiting for the male now to go after the female. Usually they mate right after because there's hormones in the water. I wouldn't be surprised if they did it already and we probably missed it. So that was the female. And these little white bits floating around here, that's the sperm. So usually right after birth, like I said earlier, there's hormones in the water and the males sense that and they instinctively know which female to mate. So this is the male. There's possible two males in this tank. So it's one of these two males. And see, there's more sperm right there, the white stuff floating around. It's like egg white yogurt looking and this is the female that gave birth so from this moment we mark the date and uh, what's today's date today's the uh, today's April 12th so what I would do is mark the date down April 12th and then I add on four months to that date and usually that's the gestation period so from her current uh, or, or the 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 birth from today you can see here I have it written down here that um, she gave birth on December 19th and she's due to give birth on April 19th and she had nine pups last time around so now what I would do now is mark down today's date and you know that I found sperm and add four months to it and the clock is reset and that's approximately when she will give birth again so hopefully all you guys have learned a little bit more about how breeding stingrays work and uh, if I can catch it again in four months I'll make a video again but I am expecting a couple of more females like this one and this one and this one so if we can get it that's great and hopefully next time I can catch them mating for you. I know everyone likes to see that. It's pretty interesting to see. So catch you guys next time.